I'm at the Duke of Richmond Hotel in St. Peterport in the beautiful island of Guernsey. There's obviously an African influence on the design here, which I love. It's so unique, especially in Guernsey. I'm Norbert Stump, I'm the general manager of the Duke of Richmond Hotel here in St. Peterport in Guernsey. I'm in the industry for, for a good 25, 30 years now and was probably the, the only gypsy in the family, um, leaving after I did my apprenticeship in, uh, in Germany and uh, went straight to London to, to learn the language and get some experience which uh, I carried on and I never looked back. And, moved forward and travelled travelled the world really. Afternoon tea at the Duke of Richmond, something very special, very different and very popular on the island. It's, it's a different presentation, there's a lot of food on the tray or I should say on, on the bench. It's the presentation we're using a little picnic bench and we have obviously scones that we again bake here in the hotel prepared from, from scratch and we've got some beautiful mango and chocolate tarts on there and we can go on and on. It's, it's delicious, you have to come and try it. idea of, of obviously food within within Red Canation hotels not just the hotel is obviously um, going back to to the owner uh, Mrs. Tolman who started the hotels many many years back down in South Africa and um, her passion was always the food element and um, we today we have in all hotels in all the restaurants we, we use some of her dishes within the menu so they are integrated Little picnic benches were were cut and put together in the hotel, and chef put a beautiful selection on onto those little benches. And everything is is prepared and made in house, and it's a selection of different sandwiches. So the location of the hotel is obviously right in the, in the middle of uh, St. Peter Port. We've got Cambridge Park right next to us. We've got uh, Candy Park literally a stone throw away from us. And being on the Sun Terrace, you have some beautiful views over the harbour and the neighbouring islands. We just had the most amazing afternoon tea. The attention to detail was something else. And the staff here are so attentive too. I love it.